dear children so this is the continuation of the previous video so we were discussing about a poem i am the land in previous video isn't it hope you all understood so far i have explained two pa paragraphs isn't it so land here is saying i am the land i wait you say you own me i still wait you shout i lie patient you buy me i wait with muddy hopes and carlarts i i stare so till here i have explained isn't it so look at the third para the para goes like this then someone tickles me plants life fruit grass trees children dance someone sings then someone tickles me tickles means exact meaning in kannada is kachaguli idu tickling tickles kachaguli anna irtakkantadakke tickling anthe heli tickles anthe heli karitare here in this poem tickles means plows plows in the sense uludu bhoomiyanna ulume maartakkantadakke the process of doing a or digging or forming is called plows plow negilalli hoortakkantadu tractor tiller galalli ivaga nelavanna hoodudu bhoomiyanna uludana nodidire alva for that process is called plows so plowing of the land so by doing or by tickling by plowing the land what land is feeling she is feeling like someone is tickles me someone tickles me yaro kachaguli idu rithinalli anustha ide nange plants life plants life so what do we do so we plow the land we put seed isn't it so beejagalanna nedtivi navu we grow plants maragalanna belitivi yake why do we plow land to get a good crop ಒಳ್ಳೆ ಬೆಳೆಯನ್ನ ಬೆಳೆಯೋದಿಕ್ಕೆ ನಾವು ಭೂಮಿಯನ್ನ ಉಳ್ತೀವಿ ಗೊಬ್ಬರವನ್ನ ಹಾಕ್ತೀವಿ ಗಿಡಗಳನ್ನ ನೆಡ್ತೀವಿ ಮರಗಳನ್ನ ನೆಡ್ತೀವಿ ವಿ ವಿ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಸಿ ಫ್ರೂಟ್ಸ್ ಪ್ಲಾಂಟ್ಸ್ ಫ್ಲವರ್ಸ್ ಎವ್ರಿವೇರ್ ಆನ್ ದಿ ಅರ್ತ್ ಇಸ್ಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಸೊ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಲ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಇಸ್ ಸೇಯಿಂಗ್ ವಾಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಮೋರ್ ಮೋಸ್ಟ್ ರೀಜಾಯ್ ಫುಲ್ ಆರ್ ವಾಟ್ ಈಸ್ ದ ಥಿಂಗ್ ದಟ್ ಲ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಇಸ್ ಫೀಲಿಂಗ್ ವೆರಿ ವೆರಿ ಹ್ಯಾಪಿ ಅಬೌಟ್ ಈಸ್ everywhere she can see grass everywhere greenery then someone tickles me yaro nelavanna ulta idare gidavanna nedta idare maravanna nedta idare everywhere shade shade in a sense under the shade of the trees maragala neragalli en aagta ide we plant life fruit grass trees children dance someone sings so by planting the tree farmer what is he going to uh, give it to the nature by planting the tree he is giving a very good atmosphere to all of us isn't it that is the reason we say one person per person we should plant at least one tree in our life is it possible so can you all do it similarly so by planting a uh, life by planting a uh, saples gidagalanna nedodrinna dodda dodda maragalage enagutte olle gaali belku barutte olle gaali irutte olle neralu sigutte aa neralalli enagutte children dance so where do children dance usually so they do usually dance under the shade of the tree wherever fruits are there wherever plants are there wherever Uh, you know flowers are there in that particular atmosphere children like to dance yes or no yes so they like that kind of atmosphere you all let's say nivellaru kuda city alli beldirthira anta ankoli so where where do you want to spend your uh, holidays in your home town in your native place alli neevu you wanted to spend your ಹಾಲಿಡೇಸ್ ಅಲ್ವಾ ಅಜ್ಜಿ ಮನೆಗೆ ಹೋಗ್ತೀರಾ ಅಜ್ಜನ ಮನೆಗೆ ಹೋಗ್ತೀರಾ ಮರದಲ್ಲಿ ಏನಾದರೂ ಹಣ್ಣುಗಳನ್ನು ಕಿತ್ತು ತಿಂತೀರಾ ಆ ಥರ ಒಂದು ವಾತಾವರಣ ಎಲ್ರಿಗೂ ಇಷ್ಟ ಆಗತ್ತೆ ಅಲ್ವಾ ಸಿಮ
here land is saying the earth is saying the most beautiful the most rejoiceful thing for me is that someone plowing planting trees everywhere i can see flowers everywhere i can see fruits children dancing someone sings someone sings melodious song ಕೆಲವೊಬ್ರು ಆ ಹಾಡುಗಳನ್ನ ಪ್ರಕೃತಿಯನ್ನು ನೋಡಿ ಹಾಡುಗಳನ್ನ ಬರೀತಾರೆ ಹಾಡು ಹೇಳ್ತಾರೆ ಅದೆಲ್ಲ ನನ್ಗೆ ತುಂಬಾ ಖುಷಿ ಕೊಡುತ್ತೆ ಅಂತ ಹೇಳಿ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಹೇಳ್ತಾ ಇದ್ದಾರೆ ಯು ಕೆನ್ ಅಬ್ಸರ್ವ್ ದಿ ಡಿಫ್ರೆನ್ಸ್ ಬಿಟ್ವೀನ್ ದ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಟೂ ಪ್ಯಾರಾಸ್ ವಿತ್ ದಿಸ್ ತರ್ಡ್ ಪ್ಯಾರಾ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಎಂಟೈರ್ಲಿ ಡಿಫ್ರೆಂಟ್ ಇಸಂಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಇನ್ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಟೂ ಪ್ಯಾರಾ ವಾಟ್ ಲ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಇಸ್ ಸೇಯಿಂಗ್ ಆರ್ ಯು ಆಲ್ ಅಬ್ಸರ್ವಿಂಗ್ ವಾಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಹ್ಯಾಪ್ನಿಂಗ್ ದ ಡಿಫ್ರೆನ್ಸ್ ಬಿಟ್ವೀನ್ ದೀಸ್ ಪ್ಯಾರಾಸ್ so in first two para land is saying saying what is she she is saying to all of us is i am waiting even though you are not the real owner of the land you you do whatever you wanted to do you buy me you sell me you say i am the owner of the land but still i wait for you to understand anta heldru here here in the third stanza th- third para land is saying i am very very happy when earth is full of trees when earth is full of river earth is full of songs children dance all these things make me makes me very happy anta heli heltare so look at the next para you come with guns so again she wanted to express her frustration irritation yen aagta ide bhoomige you come with guns who come with guns usually policemen come with guns uh, army come with guns alva sainikru gun galanna yavaglu hidkondirtare horata madode avar kelsa yuddha madode avar kelsa andre rakshaneyanna kododikoskara so why do we have all these things why do we have children tell me we put boundaries to separate the nation separate the country isn't it alva so we put separate fence to separate the land we put fence galanna haaktivi beeli galanna haaktivi boundary galanna kattivi there is a loc line of control is there right so we always fight with pakistan we always fight with china to save our save our life so all these things are happening day in and day out not only with india and pakistan everywhere in the world you can see war yuddha galu nadiyutte yakagutte this is my land this is my country we are indians we are americans we are chinese the that this everything you might have seen idellalu kuda navu igina jagattinalli navu nortivi you come with gun guns because of the smoke of the war smoke of the gun because of the population what is happening yen aagta ide bhoomige idella agodrinda bomb gala ondu smoke inda gun gala smoke inda idella adu nange yen aagta ide a chain link necklace a chain link necklace nodi they have given in a glossary chain link chain link means ಕಬ್ಬಿಣದ ಸರಪಳಿ ಕಬ್ಬಿಣದ ಸರಪಳಿಯನ್ನ ಹಾಕಿರ್ತಾರೆ ಅಲ್ವಾ ಸೊ ನಿಮ್ ಮನೆಗಳೆಲ್ಲ ಸಾಕಿರ್ತಕ್ಕಂತಹ ಪೆಟ್ಗೆ ಕಬ್ಬಿಣದ ಸರಪಳಿಯಿಂದ ಕಟ್ಟಿರ್ತೀರ ಬೇರೆಯವರನ್ನ ಕಚ್ಚಬಾರ್ದು ಅಂತ ಹೇಳಿ ಕಟ್ಟಿರ್ತೀರ ಅಲ್ವಾ ಸಿಮಿಲರ್ಲಿ ಲ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಇಸ್ ಸೇಯಿಂಗ್ ಚೈನ್ ಲಿಂಕ್ ನೆಕ್ಲೆಸ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ಫೆನ್ಸ್ ಓಕೆ ಲೆಟ್ ಸಿ ಇಂಡಿಯಾ ಓಕೆ around india there is a border we call this is our border to separate the nations china pakistan afghanistan sri lanka so everywhere we can see boundary we put a fence everywhere isn't it to separate states also we put a fence all these fence how is it looking land as according to the land as per her perception ಏನ್ ಅನ್ಕೋತಾ ಇದಾರೆ ಆಲ್ ದೀಸ್ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ಆಫ್ ದಿಸ್ ಫೆನ್ಸ್ ಐ ಆಮ್ ಫೀಲಿಂಗ್ ಲೈಕ್ ಸಮ್ಮನ್ ಟೈಡ್ ಮೀ ಯೂಸಿಂಗ್ ದಿಸ್ ಚೈನ್ ಲಿಂಕ್ ಕಬ್ಬಿಣದ ಸರಪಣಿಯನ್ನ ಉಪಯೋಗಿಸ್ಬಿಟ್ಟು ನನ್ನ ಕತ್ತನ್ನ ಯಾರೋ ಹಿಸ್ಕಿದ ಹಾಗೆ ಆಗ್ತಾ ಇದೆ ನನ್ಗೆ ಅಂತ ಹೇಳಿ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಹೇಳ್ತಾ ಇದಾರೆ ಅ ಚೈನ್ ಲಿಂಕ್ ನೆಕ್ಲೆಸ್ ಚೋಕ್ಸ್ ಮೀ ಚೋಕ್ಸ್ ಚೋಕ್ಸ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಸಫೋಕೇಟ್ಸ್ 
suffocates have you heard about suffocate this, this word suffocating you are sitting in a room so you closed all the windows doors air is not coming inside so what will happen after 5 minutes 10 minutes you will feel suffocation breathless usradadike enagutte kashta agutte ninge alva makes one breathless usradadike nanage kashta aagta ide anta who is telling land is saying because of this fence because of this chain link necklace i am feeling like breathless it is all suffocating me nange usradadike aagta illa yake ee reetiyalla horaata vannu neevu maartta idira idu nandu ee desha nandu adu nandu idinindu anta yake horaata idira nivella ant heli land is saying to all of us so again here you can identify a figures of speech personification personification so a chain link necklace fence is having uh, do fence is having a life fence ge jeeva idya iga nav beeli haaktiv alva a beeli ge jeeva idya illa alva but poet is you can observe figures of speech here poet is expressing land's feeling through this poem saying a chain link necklace ಚೋಕ್ಸ್ ಮೀ ನಾವು ಉಸಿರು ಕಟ್ಟಿಸ್ತಾ ಇದೆ ನನಗೆ ಜೀವ ಇಲ್ಲದೆ ಇರೋದ್ರಲ್ಲಿ ಜೀವವನ್ನ ತುಂಬಿ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಹೇಳ್ತಾ ಇದ್ದಾರೆ ಎಗೇನ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಎನ್ ಎಕ್ಸಾಂಪಲ್ ಫಾರ್ ಪರ್ಸಾನಿಫಿಕೇಶನ್ ಯು ಆಲ್ ಶುಡ್ ಅಬ್ಸರ್ವ್ ಆಲ್ ದೀಸ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ಸ್ ಫಿಗರ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಸ್ಪೀಚ್ ಆರ್ ದೇರ್ ಪಾಸ್ಟ್ ಟೆನ್ಸ್ ಪ್ರೆಸೆಂಟ್ ಟೆನ್ಸ್ ವೆನ್ ಐ ಎಮ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಪ್ಲೈನಿಂಗ್ ಯು ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಟು ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಯು ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಟು ಬಿ ವೆರಿ ವೆರಿ ಕೇರ್ಫುಲ್ ಯು ಪುಟ್ ಯೋರ್ ಫಿಂಗರ್ ಓವರ್ ದೇರ್ ಐ ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಓಕೆ ಫೈನ್ ಸೊ ಲುಕ್ ಎಟ್ ದಿ ಲಾಸ್ಟ್ ಪ್ಯಾರಾ even though all these things are happening on the world on me nanna bhoomiya mele idella aagta idru kuda again saying i wait nanu kaaytini for what so angrily so land is very very angrily it is saying you cannot put a fence around the planet earth i am the land i wait even though you put a fence around the country fence around the state fence around the world you cannot put a fence you know around the planet ee bhoomi idella aa bhoomi alli ivella ullana naavu kaantini madhyadalli neer irutte so land iruvantaha jaga ella ide we can put a fence around the countries nations to separate nations isn't it but what land is saying here you what and all you do you shout you buy you sell whatever you wanted to do i am not going to stop you but there is a time for each and everything there is a limit you cannot remember mankind manushare neevu nenpitkoli you cannot put a fence around the planet earth bhoomiya sutta ninge beliyanna haakodikke yavattu aagalla because i am the land nanu thai bhoomi thai nanu nannanna eno haal maadodikke spoil maadodikke finally nim kaiyalli aagalla ant heli helta idare and still i wait anta helta so what you have to do is you have to read the poem first and try to understand look at the glossary as well and practice and uh, questions like as you have seen who do you think is the speaker of the poem you know land is a speaker of the poem i wait everywhere you can see i wait i wait isn't it in line 1 suggests the feeling of annoyance patience disgust patience alla so i am the land i wait anta helodalli thalme gunavanna navu nortivi so hige thumba questions galide i am going to send you the notes after this class fine all of you so there are lot of things as i said there are lot of things that we have to understand being a mankind we should stop spoiling this earth bhoomiyanna navu en maadbeku ಸೇವ್ ಮಾಡಬೇಕು ವಿ ಶುಡ್ ಆಲ್ವೇಸ್ ಸೇವ್ ಅರ್ತ್ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಗಿವಿಂಗ್ ಲಾಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ ಫಾರ್ ಅಸ್ ಟು ಲೀವ್ ಬದುಕೋದಿಕ್ಕೆ ಬೇಕಾಗಿರ್ತಕ್ಕಂತಹ ಪ್ರತಿಯೊಂದು ಈ ಭೂಮಿ ಕೊಡುವಾಗ ಇಸ್ ಇಟ್ ದಿ ರೈಟ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ ದಟ್ ವಿ
we should never ever do that today if we do that tomorrow definitely when earth gets angry when everything exhausts everywhere you can see flood everywhere you can see earthquake many more things isn't it so hope you all understood this beautiful poem written by marina d belagenta who's a russian poetess fine thank you all